This looks so cool. I cannot wait to style it. Do you guys like it? Yeah. The kids are here too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to a weekly vlog. I feel like I haven't done a weekly vlog in forever, so it's nice to do one again. Um, I, the week has started already, but I just realized that I didn't introduce you guys to the weekly vlog, so today's Thursday, so it's midweek, and I've done some things already throughout the week, but um, yeah, I just wanted to welcome you guys to a weekly vlog I haven't done one in a minute I just felt like I've been doing a lot of daily vlogs but yeah I wanted to do a weekly vlog just to bring you guys along my week um I think it should be a pretty decent week a lot of work I had to pick up something from Chanel not a bag <laughs> um what else just work that I'm gonna play around with the kids too so that'll be fun they'll be in this too so um yeah, that's all I can think of at the, at the moment. But yeah, and I'm going to share some new and items that I just got from Gucci, Bottega, all of that good stuff. So it's going to be a fun little vlog. So yeah, keep on watching and yeah. <laughs> okay, let's get into it. I got to get back to work and then I'll share the rest of the day. Okay, so the weather is absolutely amazing. It's pretty windy, so I don't know if you guys can hear me, but amazing it's in the middle of winter and it's 60 degrees I do not have a coat because it is beautiful outside I'm gonna see if I can pick up some nail polish at Chanel there's a Chanel boutique a beauty boutique here so let's see what we can find yes Just... all right guys so I'm picking up um, nail polish today I've had Chanel nail polish for years and they are amazing so just in the Chanel boutique picking up I think I'm gonna do this row that darker red color because I still have a black so yeah that's what we're doing today the Chanel boutique at the Avalon is absolutely stunning and they have sunglasses I'm gonna show you the glasses they have because they are absolutely amazing I love that circle pair and I might have to get those so we'll see anywho I'm gonna be back because I think I need the AirPod case, so we'll see about that. All right, so mission accomplished. Got my little bag from Chanel. Returned what I needed to return. And now, time to head back to work. I can't wait to take this mask off. It's actually irritating my skin. <laughs> I feel very accomplished because I had things that I needed to return. I bought stuff from Crate and Barrel, extra um, ornaments. Literally, were still in the box, so I returned them. And then I got a hat from Urban Outfitters and literally still in the box, so I returned that. So I'm being a better, I would say, a better shopper this year. I, If I'm not using something, I'm not just going to keep it. I'm not going to house it. I'm going to return it. So did those two things and then I picked up my nail polish from Chanel I was gonna pick up more than one but I figured let me start with the one and see if the formulas are still the same this is another thing guys a lot of these brands tend to change their formulas so you might be using a product for years and then all of a sudden you start to react different to it um, it's because sometimes the formulas change so I figured let me do the one nail polish make sure it's as good as the one that I got 10 years ago that I'm still using um, and if it's as good then I'll go back and get more so yeah but that was fun it was actually nice to get outside and just to leave the house and walk around a little bit so now I gotta run back home get something to eat for lunch and then get back to work all right can I just say my coffee is still hot I love this mug if you haven't watched my morning routine, make sure you watch because I talk about this mug and how amazing it is, and it's still hot. So yes, everyone needs this mug. The scarf is on because I have the scarf on after getting ready just for my hair to lay a little flatter, but it actually looks good with the outfit. I'm gonna share the outfit in my outfit of the day, everyday style with Moni. If you guys haven't started watching that series, make sure you check it out, and it's basically, Shit, me sharing my like real outfit of the days like not planned out not set up not no filming just what i'm wearing while i'm working from home or wearing i'm um, running errands um 
and hopefully you know to serve as some kind of inspiration and so far you guys have been so good like you guys are re you make this job so easy for me because you know your comments and your engagement just you know makes me feel really good thank you <laughs> and you guys like it so I wasn't sure how it was going to be received because I feel like everyone likes to see everyone make made up and all of that but you know the reality at least for me I don't dress up every day um, in the sense I don't you know beat my face every day I do dress up in terms of clothes but I definitely don't do the whole production so this vlog is all over the place so it's just little clips of things that have been going on PR boxes that I've received new items I purchased this whole rolling rack is like getting ready for a Zara shoot um, I literally just posted something on Instagram so I'm going to jump on that and respond to comments and I'm trying to do Instagram and YouTube responding to comments simultaneously for those who follow me especially on Instagram for years if you're not following me on Instagram make sure you follow me but those who've been following me for a long time I try my very very best to get to everybody and I'm like reading the comments and trying to get to everybody um, after a certain time I won't lie it's hard because I do get a lot of comments and I try to engage as much as possible so you know, but I really try my best, especially in the, oh, that's the back of the book, <laughs> especially in the first, like, hour. So I just posted, so I have to get back to that, but I'll bring you guys along as I work throughout the day, and, um, yeah, I'll show you all the little things I do, so I gotta get back to work. <laughs> this is another thing about me when I work. I like to have noise around me, so I've got Alexa playing my modern gospel. I have the news going on on my, um desktop and then after the news um, I'll probably still have the news in the background but at some point I'm gonna have um, I have YouTube videos just going on so I can kind of get inspiration and see what you know what's out there so I'll just play videos and that's how I kind of catch up on my YouTube videos then I have my <laughs> then I have my laptop where I'm kind of working and checking emails periodically and then we have my phone that I'm responding to comments and I get DMs while I'm doing that but I don't respond to DMs or anything else because I just try to you know focus on the comments and getting them done someone asked like what's my process and this is kind of my process so these are parts of it so I'm gonna try and share some of that with you guys in this vlog um, I personally think it's nothing super interesting but this is how I work like I have to have all of this going around me to feel focused and to feel like you know I'm on it especially when you're working by yourself so yeah I, I wouldn't say I took a break but I just I have some new things that came in that I just had to like put away and look who came to visit me my husband came down to the office um, he's getting some work done too but yes yeah, so far just finished engaging um, and now I'm going through emails. I have so many emails that are just e, but yeah, that's the part that I hate doing, but I gotta get through my emails, then finish planning my shoot for Wednesday. So yeah, that's what's going on. Nothing exciting so far. And then actually, no, I have to rework my February schedule and then start forecasting for March. So I already have an outline. So I tend to create guidelines content calendars for the first quarter and then I'm gonna start looking into my second quarter um, yeah so just trying to plan ahead as much as possible oh this was the I don't know if you guys can see the color this is the nail polish that I got from the Chanel boutique and it looks really good I really like it so far so good this is day what day is it day three of having the color on I had a little bit of chips I did two coats and then I did a third one last night, so not bad. I still haven't put a top coat on it. I'm gonna put a top coat on it tonight because I find that it it chips um, if I put too many layers and put a top coat way in advance. So I'm shooting on Wednesday, and I want my nails to look good on Wednesday. So yeah. Anywho, back to work. Look who else came to visit. Everyone's just coming to visit today. <laughs> we did Amos hair yesterday. Let me know if you guys want me to, to see how I do her hair, but she's got a lot of hair, and um, it's not always the easiest to do, but yeah. Do you love your hair? Mm -hmm. Good, good, good. It looks really pretty. Yay. 
So I just finished steaming the items that I will be shooting on Wednesday. I totally forgot to bring you guys along on that process, but these are all the pieces um, for a Zara slash um, a Zara haul and a video for how to style the colors of the year, so gray and yellow. Just how to, you know, style inspiration on different ways to style those colors together. It's really good. The outfits are amazing. Um, what else? And then I'm going to... Oh, and the trends. You guys asked. I did the poll. And you guys want to see the trend report. So I'm going to go over the trend, all the trends that are in my blog post. And in addition to that, I'm going to throw in some other trends that I'm really noticing. And I'm really seeing retailers are just really pushing. So... I know, and I'm going to talk more about this, but I feel like, I know, well, not that I feel like, I know a lot of people see trends on runways and they're like, oh, I can't do that, I can't do that. But basically with the trend report that I'm going to deliver for, to you guys, I'm going to show you how you're already on trend and how those trends are actually already in your closet. Um, you've probably picked up some of these things without even thinking that, well, actually this is inspired by this major trend, so I'm on trend. So you guys are a lot more stylish than you think. So anywho... Stay tuned for that. It's coming out soon. I'm very excited about it. But yeah, that's what I've been up to. Now I have to, what else do I have to do? I've got a few things on the calendar, so yeah. Let's keep the day going. Hey, okay, so today is shooting day. That's why you guys are on top of me um, because I'm using my vlogging camera to shoot for hauls, so. I'm going to probably use my phone to show you guys a little bit of what's going on, but I have my makeup, got my wig on, and it's going to be a fun shoot. I'm trying to be ambitious and tackle 22 looks. Wish me luck. I did it. <laughs> I just finished shooting, I think, 26 outfits. So three videos, 26 outfits, two wigs later. Um, I'm exhausted. All I'm running on is some coffee, and I haven't even finished my coffee mug. I'm super tired. Um, I was gonna show you guys my setup. I'll still show it to you, but it's a mess at this point. And I was keeping it so nice and neat and I was putting everything back and then afterwards when my head started spinning, I was just like, okay, I'm getting out of this. I'm getting out of this, onto the next, onto the next, but I did it. I didn't know if I would be able to do it. My cleaning lady's coming at three, so the goal was to start at 8.30 and finish before then so it's all uh, hey Siri what time is it 158 so not bad so I'm gonna get something to eat I'm starving then I'm gonna put everything away who else cleans before the cleaning lady comes like but I don't know yeah anywho I, I, I do that I do but yes um, loving this wig I definitely think I need to get more if you guys want information on the wigs that I'm wearing just let me know and I'll, I'll send it to you. Actually, I think I'll just have it in the description box. But yeah, I'm so tired. Okay, so we're gonna go over some of the new in items I have. Um, I think one or two things you might have seen in hauls already, but yeah. So we're gonna start with this, this box and then I'll show you guys the rest. But yeah, I tend to buy a lot from net porte um, I just find, I think because they always have my shoe size, so I just feel like they have my shoe size, so I just tend to buy stuff from them. So I was looking for this particular item at quite a few stores, and nobody had it. And <laughs> Netaporte was the only one that had this beautiful Gucci sweater in, well, not necessarily in my size. This is an, um... I can't remember if it's a large or an extra large, but I wanted it to be oversized, so it's an extra large. So we're gonna try it on together and see if this will be my new favorite sweater. All right, so just got some goodies in from net porte Can't wait to show you what I ordered. There's one particular item in here that I've been eyeing for a minute, and I finally justified purchasing it. So I will show you guys. And it is this Lueve belt. So pretty. 
Okay, hopefully it looks as good on. The leather has a bit of wrinkle in it, but with this particular leather, if I'm correct, it's cow calf skin and it's been molded so you tend to get some of that um, but yes I will look and double check and see how it looks and how I feel about it on because there is a bit of I and mean, I used to work for a leather company so I get it with the scratches but <laughs> this belt costs nine hundred and ninety dollars I want the best one <laughs> anywho let's see okay so another package just arrived and this one is by Baked by Melissa, which is, oh, looks like a lot of cupcakes and treats for Valentine's Day. This is so cool. Their cupcakes and their stuff is so good, and they ship all across the U.S., so this is really cool. Yum. If you guys haven't tried this, you need to try it. Like, it's really, really good. So, yeah, and then that's like the freezer shipping bag, so. Yum, the kids are gonna love this. Okay, so just got this in, and about to open it up to see what it is, but it's a pretty cool box. Hmm, all right, let's open it up. All right, so got this really cool package from Lion State for the new movie, Fatal, that's coming out. Um, June, sorry, January 8th. Um, and they sent a bottle of wine and these wine glasses. And this candle smells really, really good. Very excited about the candle. I love the fact that it came, the wine came in this really nice um, case, which is very cool. Uh, I guess I can use this again and gift it to somebody because that's really cool. I like that. But yeah, and oh, this throw, I actually thought it was cashmere, but it's not. Um, but it feels amazing. I love the fact that it's black. I've never for some reason bought a black throw, but I really really like the idea of that. So Definitely going to watch this. Um, if you guys watch it, let me know what you think um, Yeah, thanks guys. This is a great media package. I love media kits that I can really use so this is really good Thank you Okay, so I just got this in. This is a jumpsuit from Banana Republic from their BR Standards collection. Um, I forgot that I picked this. So they basically send me their line sheets and I pick what I like, but this looks so cool. I cannot wait to style it. Do you guys like it? Yeah! The kids are here too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 my babies anywho we love this Itaro suggested that I wear them with the converse but I was thinking of wearing them with combat boots and I think I'm gonna do my Obi belt with it Just switch it up a little bit um, we'll see don't worry your 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 um, opinion is appreciated thank you just got in another package from Vita Porte. Um, so this is, well, I'm unboxing it. I guess we're unboxing it together. The Le Weve Obi belt. So I got one already in black. This one is this beautiful green, but the black one was too small. Um, so I decided to send that back and then I got this one. So I'm going to try this one on. Hopefully it fits. I ordered a medium this time around. Um, yeah. Just don't like the way they package it. I feel like they just throw it in. Oh, and the other one that I got too, it had like a lot of like natural scarring on the leather, which I wasn't a fan of. <laughs> These belts are way too expensive to have that much natural scarring, even though I know it's natural. I know it's the leather, but... I just didn't want that one. So now this green one looks pretty awesome. No natural scarring. The leather looks great. Um, yeah, and just being one that worked in le for a leather company for so long, I just rather not. I know there's options to not have the scarring. So 
love the silhouette let's try it on all right guys i am so bloody happy that i returned the black one and got this green <gasps> it is everything and it it's like a gray green so this is going to be super versatile i've talked about this in my hauls green is one of those colors where at first sight you're maybe a little hesitant to pair it but when you think about every flower out there every flower regardless of color is paired with a green leaf so Green is a lot more versatile than you think. And look how great it looks with the blue. It looks fabulous, even though I don't think I would wear it this way with the sweatshirt. But then again, I might because it actually looks really good. Like, really, really good. Um, I, I love this. I love it. And the black one, the silhouette of the black one was a little different. I think this silhouette is better for me. Because it makes me look a lot more hippie. <laughs> I love this. Oh, yeah. And I'm so happy I did the medium. The small was not... Mm -mm. That was like... A, I don't know maybe European smalls are different from everyone else but this medium works perfect for me I can wear it with pieces that are thick like this I still have a little bit of space in the back and you can see that there's a little bit of space so I can wear it this way too and I can make it tighter if I'm wearing something a bit more narrow so yay I'm very excited about this okay all the outfits all the possibilities yay <laughs> I have a question for you guys. So if anyone has the Loewe belt, how do you store it? Um, I Right now I'm just going to keep it in its um, duster, but it kind of folds as it folds up. But I know it's not leaving a dent in the leather. I was going to hang it, but then I remembered that the clips would leave dents in the leather. So do you just leave it in the duster? Um, and does it come out fine every time? Just let me know because you know i'm sure a few of you might have the belt so yeah let me know but they're um, in the description or comments rather <laughs> thanks hey guys happy saturday um Hi. in bed with the family mm -hmm. no, I'm, not I'm making bed. myself a jet and I'm, going a jet to show my, I'm going to show my mommy my car beautiful car <laughs> What are you guys making? These kids making think that you, <laughs> it's easy to just, they, they came oh, in. Oh wait, no, no, I don't think it's Showing easy. me their millionaire houses. And what else did you guys make? Uh, um, I, I'm showing my mom my, my jet and I'm my, a ghost. Yeah. See? So Emma thinks that, I'm you know, she could be a babysitter and buy a millionaire house and drive a Tesla. I'm telling her that I'm she has to work show hard you my years Tesla. to do that. Okay, let's see the Tesla. Well, I'm coming. All right. So, and then, this is my test. Clearly, we're a device home. Everybody has their devices. Okay. Well, this is my Jedi Knight so far with the robot arm. And then, Let's like, see. this is my Jedi Knight so far. Mm -hmm. uh, I can teleport to, like, like, I can teleport to the Death Star, Typhoon, Tatooine. Uh, if you people know what these are. That you would have I'm to sure, be. I'm sure we have Star Wars Look. watchers. Who watches Star Wars? We've been watching Star Wars. Who else My, watches Star Wars? Like wow, it's purple. Do they make purple Teslas? I don't think so. I think you would have to have it customized or something. Yeah. yeah. All right. Let's see what today holds. I got a duel. I'm trying well, not I'm to work really today. I'm good so. at driving we'll and I'm a ghost. Ooh. Yeah, that's making me hungry. Well, I've been I've been eating, drinking my breakfast. Got my coffee. Oh, coffee, girl. Breakfast of champions. <laughs> I, I know. Yes, exactly. Your boss is Italian. Ask him. Yeah, intra, intra, girl. I'm sure if I Google it, I'll find it. Hey, mama. Yes. Do I have fifteen dollars for February? You know I'm talking, eh? I'm trying to negotiate. You're negotiating while I'm having a phone call. Eh? Well, that's a good Save time your to have. Oh, really? You really think so? You really think so? <laughs> well, you? you're really in a good mood when you're and talking to people, so... <laughs> yeah, that's right. Did I you hear him? You. He said I'm in a good mood only when I'm talking to <laughs> When I'm talking about fashion, I'm in a good mood. My friend, come on, get out. <laughs> I was like, okay, what can I do? I spent, I woke up, I started, you know, scrolling shopping. I was like, okay, let's shop with everybody else. So I put those two out there. And so far, the top one is like, hands down. Yeah. Which, you know, and I thought the clutch was cute too, but I know it's just a clutch. What? I, I, yeah, I feel like you can do more with the top one than yeah. the second one. The second one is a clutch, is a clutch, is a clutch. You know what I mean? Yeah, Versus yeah. the top one, it looks like 
space on the side is small enough to wear it like it's a cross body yeah yeah oh cross body i think so i'm not sure i know the shoulder strap i read i i read the description and everything the shoulder strap is removable so you can wear it as a clutch which is great and then i don't know if those straps are long enough but i know i could go over my wrist so i can wear it as a wristlet for sure because it's yeah. a jawstring yeah yeah it's good girl <laughs> okay so i just got into my office it's saturday but i am doing an instagram live so pajamas on the bottom <laughs> cute top on top and thank goodness for this wig my intention was no makeup and technically I have no makeup on so it's just skin and then I did the lipstick and then I'm gonna use an Instagram filter to <laughs> make me look better but I feel like the lipstick that's the beauty of a strong red it brings all the attention here so I gotta hurry up and get on because it's about to start and of course I'm running late no I'm not running late actually I just like to be early so yeah Mm -hmm. Hi, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Good, good. Thanks for having me. And I feel like because, especially as women of color, not seeing ourselves in the major magazines and all of this stuff, I feel like that has affected a lot of people's self-confidence for many years. <laughs> Girl, I, I'm laughing right with you because when this pandemic thing hit, I never baked anything. A lot of my hauls, they're not necessarily saying go to Zara and buy stuff from Zara or go to the, it's more so saying, look in your closet. If you have anything like this, this is, this is inspiration for you to dress that way. All right, so welcome back to my closet. <laughs> um, I decided that I need to make a few little changes, nothing big. I still want to kind of like have everything custom to utilize the space better because um i i just feel like i could do more with the space there's a lot of space in here but even with taking out a lot of my summer stuff i have a few summer pieces in here but i still feel like it's just overly crowded that's my socks and <laughs> and scarf basket and it's full to the brim and maybe i just need to do anyways i need to do another closet clean out i'm constantly doing them now just to accommodate everything but yes i wanted to just add some little things here and there. I actually saw this, um, one of my friends, Amanda, um, from Lux Mommy, she had these little caddy things. So I decided to buy them. I actually bought them a while ago and I just put one in and I realized that it was actually pretty easy. So I'm gonna put another one in. I'm gonna put, I think I'm gonna put one here. My shoes are actually all, well, not all of them, but I have a lot of shoes back here. And this is kind of where I put things, or the hangers, whenever I take something out and wear it. I put the hangers here, so I know that they're there, and then I put them back. Um, as opposed to just leaving them in their places, so. I think I'm going to put one of the caddies here, and then another one beside my pants and stuff here, so. Or, actually, I think I might leave that there, and put one here. That's a little higher than that one, and then one here for pants. So I think that's what I'm going to do now. And I'll show you guys how I did it, and I'll have the links to it as well, but that's what I'm doing right now. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I think what I bought comes in a package of three. Um, the instructions are horrible. <laughs> really, really bad. Um, but it comes with an option to screw into the wall and to screw into wood. This is what I'm doing, putting it in there. And then these two things help it go straight into the wall so we're going to screw this in to the wall and then this just slides in so this is really all I need to make it happen it's actually a lot easier than I thought it would be I thought it was gonna be difficult and yes I'm in my pajamas <laughs> this is what I'm doing first thing in the morning right there. Look how easy that was and I really thought it was going to be long and tedious and it actually looks really cool like it's part of the overall thing. So now I'm just going to put my stuff back. What do you put on the pole? So just things that I want to wear. So especially now that it's down here on this side, if I want to wear these pants, um, I can just, nice. yeah, I can just put that there 
and the night before so this will help me in terms of getting ready quicker faster and then over here we did this one and if I decide that I want to wear those pants with well these are in the wrong place to begin with but let's say I want to wear those pants with this sweater I just do that so and it works exactly so my getting ready process is easier now so I now have my sweater there and my pants there and yeah yay the little things that bring me joy <laughs> It works, right? Yes. Thanks for helping. Really does. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you for watching this vlog. If this was your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. Don't forget to give this vlog a two thumbs up. Um, yeah, the more interest you guys show in the vlogs, the more I will try my best to do them. So yeah, let me know what you wanna see next. But yes, make sure you check out all the video content because there's so much, there's a lot of outfits and a lot of everything. So check it all out. Thank you for watching. Check out the website. Follow me on Instagram. That's where it's at. That's where all the fashion, everything. Everything. <laughs> all right. Till next time. Bye, guys.